But like, if you're just in a rush and like you want a ponytail, look at this. Like that's it. That's all. Like look. This took two seconds. It looks like my hair is done, sis. And it's not. Hello, hey, it's Ali J, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about this headband wig that I got from Love Me Hair. Um, so I'm going to be showing you guys the whole unboxing, um, how you can style the hair in different styles and how it's really the perfect hair for lazy naturals like me. Um, so the reason I really, really wanted one was I saw this kind of wig, like I want to say in maybe December. and. Um, I just thought about it for a long time and I was like, let me just wait a few weeks before I decide to make that purchase. So I um, did and I ended up seeing tons of ads, um, women wearing their hair in different styles, like wearing it in like little ponytail, wearing it in high ponytail, wearing it half up, half down. Like people were like really styling this hair and like the catch is that you don't need glue and you don't need lace. So that's perfect for me um, it's perfect for girls who have careers where they they're running around a lot they don't want to spend time making sure their glue is gluing and their lace is lacing um, it's perfect for girls who do, who work out a lot like I'm someone who likes to work out I'm gonna sweat that lace is not gonna stay on my forehead it's gonna slide back and I just can't deal with that every day in addition I just want a disclaimer before I start this video that I completely bought this on my own this is not sponsored uh, all right so I don't want this video to be too too long so I'm going to just go ahead and get into the unboxing so this is what the box looks like it comes in this nice purple box I thought the bow was a cute touch you first open it you have a little note here um, this says enjoy your hair journey from now on from Helena the founder of love me hair I open it up and I have the hair here um, and then another reason I got this is because it also came with like a bunch of headbands and I was like, that's perfect. Um, I actually already have tons of headbands. Um, what natural doesn't? So you have like a cheetah print headband. These are like the cross type. Like this is actually what I wear all the time, like the cross type headbands. You have like this like yellow one, which is like really cute. Another kind of like floral-ish looking one. This one is so soft. Um... Then you have this one as well. Then you have like a camo one. I don't like camo. Um, it also comes with this little like cute little like iridescent pack thing and they have like some essentials in here. So I actually needed another one of these. Wow, because my other one, it's so crusty now. Do a little edge brush. Let's see what else is in here. Some bobby pins. A little like this is cute, like a love me clip, like to put in your hair. This is probably, this looks like kind of like a hair tie um, type thing. Like you can just tie it around your head. Um, some kind of band. I'm not sure what this is for. I'm gonna have to look that up. I don't know what that's for. And then they give you some tweezers. I actually needed some tweezers. Awesome. So they give you tweezers and then you have this cute little baggie. That's cute. And then it comes with um, two wig caps, which I'll be using one of these today. And then like a little thing, um, what is this? It's like little instructions about how to care for the hair, which you have, if you wanna straighten the hair, or blow dry it, how to do that. Also like refunds and things like that. So that's cute. All right, so let's get started with styling the wig. So first things first, I'm gonna put my hair in a style that is going to allow me to put this wig cap on. Okay, so I have it in this kind of like twisted bun thing. The reason why I am showing you guys me doing this with not much effort on my underneath hair is because that's kind of the point of this for me. Like. I want to be able to put my hair in twists and I think what I'm gonna do is put my hair in twists and just throw this wig on um, because that's kind of the point so now I'm gonna do my edges so I did my edges like two minutes ago and I had this on here for like 30 seconds um, and I'm about to take this off 
Here's my edges all done. And now we can get to the part we've all been waiting for, which is looking into this hair and seeing if it's really worth it. So I'm gonna take it out now. And a lot of people claimed that this hair was good right out of the pack. So that's why I just wanted to film myself unboxing it so that I could see if that's really true. So let me shake it out. So I ended up getting the wet and wavy because um, I just felt that, you know, if my edges do frizz up, um, it, like it wouldn't look too crazy if I like had wet and wavy hair coming from them, you know. Um, but the hair is 100% human. Um, and I've seen plenty of videos of women um, straightening it, blow drying it, all that. I definitely won't be doing that. Um, I'm also going to take a little mousse to help with the frizz. So I'm going to put a little bit of that on here. All right, so we do have very minimal shedding. Um, you can't even really see it, but it's just a little bit of shedding. So it already has a headband on it. Um, this is like a black kind of like spandexy feeling one. It has two combs, oh three, three combs here in the front and then like a big comb in the back and then it has like the headband also has like this Velcro thing to kind of like secure it. So let me put it on. Okay, so I have the front um, couple combs in. I still need to put the comb in over here. All right, that's in. And then I need to secure it with this. In the back. So that it's not coming off my head. Mm. All right. So this is how it pretty much looks on like regularly. I mean, you can also bring it up a little more. Like I saw some people bring it up and like barely keep their edges out. Like you can do it like that. Like how I have it right now. Um, I want the top to be just a little flatter. So yeah, when I do my twists, I'm definitely gonna have to do like small twists and make the top a little flatter. But I mean, I'm not complaining too much because I think for the price and the ease that this was a great purchase. My edge is already acting up, but this is what it looks like from the side. I'm going to show you the other side. And then here's the back. All right, so I've even seen girls wear it up like put the hair up. Let me see if I can do that. Even just having the ponytail here is just so cute. Look how cute that is. And keep in mind, keep in mind, this is me doing this without really doing my hair underneath. So like this could look even better. Like if I really did my hair, this would look even better if I did my hair um, like really flat underneath. Cause like right now it's like in like a really lazy bun type thing. I didn't really try. Um, so yeah, like, it looks really cute. I'm actually, like, super happy about this. Like, I was kind of scared that it was going to be, like, trash. <laughs> but it's so cute. It is so cute. Let me stand up a bit so you can see all of it. So, and this is without even putting the headband on. So, like, you're supposed to actually wear headbands. Um, and I am going out today, so I will wear a headband. So let's see. I think I'm going to do this one. Because I like how soft it is. Um, so yeah, let me put this headband on. And see what it looks like. And what I like also is that this is so secure that when I'm like tugging on it and like like if I want to like style the hair or anything like that, like it's not like, you know, coming back. Like, you know how some wigs, you'll go to like put it in a ponytail and it'll like um, kind of pull the wig back. Yeah, this isn't doing that. All right, so here we go. So I just put 
the headband on. Um, so this is what it looks like, like with the headband. Again, remember, like you see this right here. This could be so much flatter and look so much cuter, but like I did not really try to style my hair. So this is how it looks um, with like a headband on. I'm gonna stand up for you again so that you can see. Um, yeah, this is so cute. So I put the headband on and this is the headband I'm gonna wear today. And I said that I'm gonna show you guys different styles um, because I personally like got it because you can do different styles with it. So I wanna see if that's true. Like I've seen people do half up, half down. I've seen people do all types of stuff with it. So I'm like, I wanna be able to do all that. I wanna be able to wear my hair, I wanna wear it. So this is what it would look, Ooh, let me change my hand. So this is what it would look like half up, half down. All right, so I just put it in a ponytail. Um, this is how it looks in the ponytail. So that looks really cute. I'm gonna do my hair better underneath because like right now, like if I wanted to do a high ponytail, that would look a mess because my bun is like right here. <laughs> but like if you're just in a rush and like you want a ponytail, look at this. This is... I'm just so happy right now, like, mm, I'm just so happy right now because this is just such an easy, easy hairstyle. No glue, no lace is needed. Like this, this is it if you are a lazy natural. All right, so I hope that this was helpful and I hope that this kind of gave you an idea of like what's out there and that... Um, you know, headband wigs are kind of perfect for lazy naturals like me. If you could please give this video a thumbs up and if you could also please subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Um, thank you so, so much for watching and I will see you next time.